I put the solar system together real quick to make sure everything worked properly. After knowing everything was working the way it should, I'm gonna take everything down and do a better job putting it together. I remove everything off the wall. Then I use three stud and put a plywood on top of it. Then add a cement board. Then I add the two inverters. And then I add 300 amp buzz bar, positive and negative. I use a back scorer to cut off the layer of the battery cable. I cut it at an angle. I find doing it that way, it's easier coming off. Then I put on the wire lug. This is the crimping tool I am using. I will leave a link in the description if you're interested in getting it. It also comes with this wire cutter. You require two hands to do this, but I'm just doing this as a demonstration. I do the crimping in two area. Then I add the shrinking cover. Before I crimp the second one, I make sure the orientation gonna be just right. I mark it with a sharpie, then I crimp it, and then I add the shrinking tool on top of it. I use a light bulb to quick charge the inverters. I notice I forgot to remove the washer and the nuts. I'm gonna have to remove them and do another round of pre-charge again. I usually try to hold it for 10 seconds. I think that should be enough. Then I put it in and add the washer and the nut. Then make sure I tie everything down and make sure all my connections are going into the right place before I power everything on. And the first one is power on. The second one is also on. Today was a good day to do this project because it is really cloudy outside. There wasn't much energy coming in. This is my temporary setup for the solar. I only have four solar panels connected to it right now. Each of the solar panels produce around 405 watt. That's what they are rated to, 405 each panel. This is how everything looks for now. I still have some more work to do to complete this project. This is the inverter I used in the previous video and I've been using it for a couple of days and so far the house used on 20 kilowatt. I will leave link for all the parts I use in this video in the description below. Thank you very much for coming to my channel. Have a good one.